According to the Electoral Commission chairperson, Simon Yabakama Mugenyi, campaigns have been banned until further notice in those areas following a meeting with health experts who recommended suspension of campaigns to limit the rates of COVID-19 transmission. Uganda goes to the polls on January 14 to elect the president a member of parliament. The presidential election has attracted 11 candidates, including incumbent President Yoweri Museveni and new boys on the block, Shadundo East MP Robert Shagulanyi and Forum for Democratic Change President Patrick Oboy Amuriat, who have been at the receiving end of police brutality thus far for allegedly violating coronavirus guidelines. Interestingly, the same health experts in the Electoral Commission cities last week called for another lockdown ahead of Christmas holidays to limit transmission. But government objected the call, saying now people must take individual responsibility by observing the recommended standard operating procedures of social distancing, face mask wearing and hand washing. The opposition has often pointed out that while government insists on limiting mass gatherings at political gatherings, other mass events and places like weddings, barriers and markets continue to attract masses without any police intervention. Gatherings at political gatherings, other mass events and places like where markets continue to attract any police intervention. Gatherings at political gatherings. Other mass events and places like weddings, gatherings at political gatherings, other mass events and places like weddings. Gatherings at political gatherings, other mass events and places like weddings.